Colby Rich is the guy who delivers the big hit for Cam in the sixth inning. Tie ball game, 3-3. You step up to the plate with the bases loaded. Take us through the at-bat. Um, well, Lane got intentionally walked before me. And uh, when a big game, I tend to get a little antsy at the plate. I knew I just had to take a deep breath and look for my pitch. And I ended up driving it. Have you uh, been at the plate many situations where Lane has been intentionally walked this year or in the past? And, and does that kind of change? You go if there was something to prove? Um, this year, not as much as last year, but uh, last year he's intentionally walked a lot. And like I said, I just got to look for my pitch and stay, uh, stay disciplined and look for my pitch. Did you know it was going to drop right off the bat? I mean, it was maybe a chance for it to be caught. Um, I had a pretty good idea it was going to drop just the way, uh, just where the ball was hit and where the outfielders were. Uh, what did you see from Cade on the hill, especially his first four innings throwing a lot of strikes? Yeah, like, like you said, there was a lot of strikes that he thrown. Uh, all of his pitches were working. He could pretty much put them wherever he wanted them. What are you guys, uh, I guess, what are you the most proud of here so far in your baseball careers? You guys have accomplished a lot, regular season and postseason. What stands out to you? Um, I would say, I'd say our winning percentage. I mean, that, I mean, obviously you want to play the game to win. And I guess, I mean, I think we have over 100 wins as a, as a class. So I think that's definitely what we're most proud of. And I think any of my classmates could say the same thing. They really started hitting the ball in the fifth and sixth innings, tied it at 3-3. Three, three. Were you guys rattled at all there? Have you been through some situations like that? Maybe that prepared you for it? Um, we've been through the, we've been through those, we've been through that situation before where, uh, say we're ahead or even if we're down, um, they're hitting the crap out of the ball and we just, we always seem to step up and find a way to switch the momentum to our side. Last time suiting up at home. It'll be a neutral site next round. Big crowd here tonight. Did you think about that much at all while you're out there? Yeah, I mean, there's. A, I do a lot. Of, I do a lot of thinking behind the plate. Sometimes it's not always baseball, so that's not always a good thing. But uh, just looking up at the scoreboard, I can. It's kind of a surreal moment. All right. I don't dare, dare ask what you're daydreaming about back there. But baseball. going going forward, you're playing it on Tuesday. Um, you guys have kind of been through this routine of winning a district final and preparing. So what are some things you'll do to get better? And and how do you get to know your next opponent, whoever that might be? Um, I'm not even sure who's on the other side of our, uh, who, who we have the possibility of playing. But I know that um, to get anywhere, we, we have to hit a lot better. and We can't strike out, especially striking out looking. All right. Good luck next round. Thanks.